Yes. It's me again. Yeah. And I'm back. TLC. <laughs> Something about this girl, man. From around my way. Never try to hold back your feelings. Hey guys, so it's me. I know I've been gone for about a good month, you know. And in the YouTube world, that's really long and everything. So, you know, I'm back and I'm bringing you guys a hair review. Now, you guys know if you follow me on Instagram, I love switching it up. Like, I love switching up my hair. And I got sent this hair by a company named Hair Addict. And let me tell you guys, you see how I keep running my hands to this hair? This is how you know, this is how you know I'm messing, I'm messing with it, like, this is how you know I love a hair if I just can't stop running my hands through it because it's like butter, like. Okay, so these are the specs of the inches and the, um, the kind of hair that I have on my hair. So I have Indian straight and I have them in a lot of different um inches i have from 22 to 24 i got three bundles of that and i got an 18 um frontal and i'm gonna tell you guys about the frontal too in a few and i also got um a 18 to 20 inches so basically, you don't get like one, like, you know how some companies, they have 18, 20, 22, but this company, it goes from 18 to 20, but like, let's say you ask for an 18, that's what you're going to get. So if I ask for a 20, it's going to say 18 to 20. So I'm going to show you guys how basically that looks like. I'm a sucker for packaging. Their packaging is very professional. You get like this satin, like silky bag and they have their logo and all the information that you need all right here about your hair another thing about this hair i really never um experienced that from other hair companies um when i got it it literally smelled so fresh and so good like some companies their hair don't smell like anything or some companies their hair just smell like pro like hot process you know it's been through the steamer and everything i literally smells like it's been taken care of for you it's been washed like i don't even it smells so good i just wanted to smell it like oh my god and also my other favorite thing about this hair are the ends i also have one bundle that i didn't use which is the 18 um to 20 inches so i'm gonna show you guys what that bundle looks like these ends are not plain honey all the bundles the 20 inches, the 22, they were so freaking thick. And you guys know when you get hair and they're longer, they're not thick. No, this this hair, like, I was so shook. I was like, look at that. Do you see how full look? Like, and like... I don't even know if it does you guys any justice, but the ends to me are so full, which I love. I hate stringly, like, little, you know, little bits of pieces when it comes to hair. Since you guys see I did this, you know, this, like, peekaboo, like, honey blonde, um like strand you know like streak i guess i bleached it about three times because at first i only um had a little section but then i wanted it to go a little bit more back and after that it was really really yellow which i did not like and then what i did was i used a um wella toner and it's a t11 i left it on for only 15 minutes it turned out really good and i also every time i bleach it i always um leave it in conditioner for about a good 15 minutes because we do not want that hair to be dry and obviously you guys i'm running my my hands through this through this honey blonde this is how long it is on me i'm really i'm like 5'3 so it falls let me show you guys the back 
it falls literally on my butt so let's get up um to this frontal so only thing with the frontal is um it didn't come pre-plucked but it didn't come pre-plucked but at the same time i don't know if it came pre-bleach or anything i wasn't told but to me it wasn't like that white frontal that you get it was kind of like you know like brownish so it wasn't really that bad to me what i basically did i put some foundation but i didn't do it wet i took some beauty a beauty blender and i um pat it down and i put it on there and i did some baby hair in the front which is my favorite thing to do when it comes to um frontals also the last thing about the front i also tweezed it because it did need to be tweezed as the only thing with this frontal it did need to be tweezed and needed to you know be customized and everything so just a heads up so far i have not gotten any shedding with this hair um also when i didn't make the wig i didn't cut my web so that's also prevent shedding yeah i've also washed this hair as well two times actually and it's not dry or anything it's just this hair just gives me life you guys and it's very manageable it's not you know it's not giving problems or anything but yeah you guys that is my review on this hair and i will link all the details about um this hair um and then this and I will also put the link. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and it was as You know Informative and I gave you guys as much as information as you need. Hey guys, I will see you guys in the next video